good morning or afternoon or evening, whatever time zone you're in, everyone, welcome, welcome. Final, bo uh, I say final box, final package opening for me for this new uh, Pokemon set. So you will have seen the title. This is the Pokemon Go Premium. I'm going to get the name right. It is the Pokemon TCG colon Pokemon Go Pokemon Center Elite Trainer Box Plus. Uh, yeah, so if you couldn't guess, it's only available in the Pokemon Center, which you can get them online. Um, here is one. Mewtwo on it. Let's uh, not waste any time. Let's crack it open. See what we got in it. In fact, let's let's waste a little bit of time. Of course, you know, I realise these opening uh, videos. Yep, using a top loader to get through the plastic. Yeah, these opening videos. Um, there's no reason to rush, is there? I mean, you want to get a feel, get a look, get an idea. As always, still waiting on that 1,000 subscribers, so I can update the camera to give you a better experience. Now the light is a bit aggressive. Turn it down a bit. How's that? It's uh, probably a bit dark now. Actually, it's no, that's not too bad actually. So here it is. Pokemon Go logo, got some artwork here, Mewtwo inside the Pokeball, of course, Pokemon logo, it's quite nice, it's pretty cool. Let's have a look at the book, the back, not the book. More general idea of the picture there, get up and go battle. Gear up for battle like never before, as Pokemon Go meets the Pokemon trading card game. Dragonite V-Star and Mewtwo V-Star show off immense powers, while Malmetal V-Star in its gigant uh, sorry v max excuse me in its gigantamax form smashes the competition appearing as sought after shiny pokemon radiant venusaur radiant charizard and radiant blastoise bring dazzling new strategies to the battlefield meanwhile the leaders of team instinct team mystic and team valor are ready to show their support in the pokemon tcg pokemon go expansion so the big one to note this is you get 12 booster packs happy days we want 12 you get another Mewtwo V, so I'll have another one of those. Happy days once again. 65 card sleeves. This is a special one. Oh, sorry, Pikachu. Uh, these card sleeves are different. I know usually in the um, Pokemon Go, no, sorry, the Pokemon Center version of the ETBs, they are different, but these are more different, if that makes sense. Um, so it's usually it's like the same design, but a slightly different color. But in these ones, it's actually that artwork on the, on the sleeve. Uh, 45 energy, a player's guide, 6 metal damage counter dice, 1 metal coin, one metal 2 metal condition markers, 1 acrylic V-star marker, a collector's box, of course more holding it, and code card for the TCG online. Usual sort of stuff there, most importantly you get 12 booster packs, uh, and there's some other stuff as well. What are seeing here? Oh, those are the dividers of course. Cool, so let's slide it. Ooh. Okay, that's it, slid. This one, the sleeve doesn't feature any artwork inside, so it's a bit disappointing. Might keep that though. So. Oh, cool, so this side's nice, and it's got texture as well. Even bigger, Mewtwo's coming in to headbutt you. Really loving this Mewtwo artwork, aren't they? They've just got it over all over the place. Oh, there's the player's guide. It's sort of slipped out. I think we've already gone through the player's guide. Uh, got more Pokemon Go reward thingamajiggers there. Got like three or four pages of those now. Still haven't started playing Go, so uh, those just sit on one side. We've gone through the. Uh, anything else in here worth noting? Just flicking through. No, it's the same. Already seen one of those. Don't see it again. Right, let's crack them open. There we go. Here's the annoying cardboard. Oh, is that a deck? That's a deck box. It didn't say on the back it had a deck box, did it? Does it say about anything about a deck box? Collector's box to hold any of everything. No, it says nothing about this deck box. That's pretty cool. So it's actually got something which I wasn't expecting. Um, it's just this deck box. I will most definitely be, I get a lot of use out of, it was a bit of a super thing to say, of course I get a lot of use out of deck boxes, but yeah, I have a lot of deck boxes. <laughs> uh, there's another Mewtwo V, 
Got our divider. Oh, they're uh, funky shaped dividers. They'll be staying in there, never to be uh, used. So it's over here. Oh, these are our the, the sleeves. So as you can see, it's got the design on it. Not bad. I believe that's the energy there. Yeah, energy. Not going to get those out. There's no point. All right, these are the dice. They're bloody heavy. Uh, I'm not going to use them. Don't really like them. Sorry. I don't like the metal ones. Uh, I like the different coloured ones. Same is probably going to be... Oh, there's the V-Star counter. Same is true for this dice. This uh, coin, actually. There's a hefty old coin. Uh, yeah. More for the coin collection, but... Me. Let's have a look here. Anything else? Oh, of course, there are these. Let's get that out now. The burn and poison markers, also metal now. Also pretty heavy. Yep, not going to use them. Here's the important bit. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 booster packs. 12 booster packs to open. Let's find some absolutely skits pulls. Move that down a little bit. Let's get going. Let's not waste our time here. Let's try and keep it as secretive as possible. I believe that's not a good sign. Better know what energy we're getting. It's a V star. Got Spark. Got Ariados. We got Blanc. Pom, Graticate, Larvita. Oh, oh, can we reach on? Okay. <laughs> Another one of these bloody things. <laughs> I have so many of these now. I really have no business having as many of these as I own. I'm going to put that one side out of the way. Move on to the next one. All right. First thing we pull is the, uh, just call it the full art, the full art egg. Is there a character art egg? I can check. Got the player's guide. Oh, well. There you go. Spores that surprise. One, two, three, and four. Right. Let's see. Fighting energy. The steel. The zat. The candy. The onyx. The eevee. The charmander. The apom. The bulbasaur. Another Bulbasaur, that is not a ditto. And another Blissey, that is not good. Let's go again. Just looking to my side here, I've got a pile of the last stuff I opened, and there's a Blissey on top. So, you know, got a few of those, Val. Well, I've got a few of those. Another code card. One, two, three, four. Fire. Got the egg, Melian, Candy, Bulbasaur, Kate, Tranquil, Lavatar, got a shiny lure module. What's hiding behind lure module? It is a Conkelder. Conkelder V. Another pool there. Not something I really care for too much if I'm being completely candid with the audience, but. Well, there's no butt, is there? That's it. An interesting Pokemon. An interesting card, for sure. But, where's the use in it? Hmm, could it be a deterrent for... This Pokemon's damaged by attacks during your last turn. It does that much. So, let's say an Arceus hits it for 200. That's 220, plus a choice about 250. If it's not weak. If they've done some else in play, you don't do 50. Uh, I just don't really see the point in that. What's its second attack? Flip a coin if heads attack does 90 more damage and your point is pointless. You're only really in it for the first attack, aren't you? Where's my energy? Hmm. Oh well. Magic up. P dove. Oh, I've done it completely wrong, haven't I? Slow bro. There's a Lapras. I don't know. What? <laughs> done it. <laughs> uh, oh well. Yep. Nothing to write home about there. Nothing to write home about there at all. Get another one. One, two, three, and four. Psychic. Egg. Charmeleon. Rare candy. Zatu. 
sorry, Natu. Slow poke. That is a Spinarak. That is not a Ditto. Articuno, that's actually the first non-rev Articuno I've got. So what I didn't realise is that though, well, no, I didn't realise actually, which when I first read it, I didn't really consider that they stack. I was like, well, okay, you get plus 10 damage, that's, that's okay. But, yeah, a few in play. You know, imagine, I mean, you're, you're sort of, you're, you're saying, Vikavolt, disconnect. Get three in play, doing 80. It's pretty good. I don't think I have a choice about that one there, you know. Doing 110 to a V Pokemon. Another Soul Rock. Um, <laughs> two Soul Rock in one, uh, one boost pack. Sorry if I sound not interested. I'm trying to be. I'm so interested in this. I'm so into this right now. One, two, three, four. Oh. Uh, that'll do. Close enough. Oh dear. Oh dear. There's your energy. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear, Danny. That is a Pikachu. That is a Moltres. Oh, the hits are coming thick and fast. The pulls. A pulmonary. Doesn't make sense. Sorry. Just get on with it. Oh yeah. Lightning energy, that's a good sign. That is a good sign. Lightning is good. Alright. Lightning is good. We've got an Articuno. Tyranitar. There's lightning is not good. I hate lightning. Lightning sucks. One, two, three, four to the front. Water, that's a good sign. Water's good. Okay, the crack candy camera ups. Blanche. Okay. Ugh, oh, what the hell? Ah, oh, slacking V. Lovely jubbly. Okay. Two sixty. Can do with choice but two ninety. It's not terrible. It's quite good. It has a place in Arceus, I think. So we've got two full art and one regular V. In twelve boosters. So so far, so far. We can't work out averages just yet. Fighting energy. It's a good sign. Fighting is good. We like to see fighting. Uh, where are we going with this? Glycopod. Oh, no, this is bloody, bloody Sylveon. Nope. Fighting sucks. Fighting absolutely honks. We don't like fighting at all. I just noticed that all the code cards have come through black. I'm sure there was supposed to be like a colour thing where you knew if you got good pulls or not. One, two, three, and four. We've got the V-Star counter. Steel, Zatu, Slowbro, Carp, Onyx, Eevee, Num. That is a Charmeleon. That is an Articuno. We've got two now. Lucky me. Any basic water Pokemon out there? We've got Swaycoon doing more damage. They don't play, Swaycoon's not really played anymore. It sucks now, apparently. Does it really, though? Is there any real reason to not play Swaycoon? Is Palkia that much better? I mean, is it really that much better? I'm seriously asking. Oh, Mewtwo V. Okay. Cool. But well, that was our last uh, booster. We got the Mewtwo V, the Slacking V, for art, the Conkelder Normal, the Alonin Executor Normal, and of course, the Full Art Mewtwo. So, 12 packs, one, two, three, four pulls, so one in every three, pull to V, one in three, you pull to V. So that's that for that. Now we're gonna take it online, uh, well, we're going to take it digital, get these in, and then open those and then get a game. Okay, here we go, 12 packs. Still got the uh, Pokemon Go hat going on, of course. Let's see what we get. I'm, just, I'm, I'm a bit bummed. I was hoping to get a Radiant, uh, a Radiant something. To, 
Uh. What? Unbelievable. <laughs> Unbelievable. Uh, it's always the way, isn't it? It's like, yeah, I can redo really with the nice cards physically. Dang, dude. Always the way, always the way. Lapras. Shaking my head right now. The salt. My metal V mats. I think I got like a three three of that. No, it's no, crazy. Couldn't open any physical ones, I don't think. Fortunately. Conkelder. We've seen a few of them. Let's see here, Tyranitar, Snorlax, cool. Pretty cool Snorlax, the block one. For all those control fans, the rare Pikachu. What do we work with? Another radium. <laughs> uh, I could do with those radiant cards physically. Why don't I have them? It's so annoying. Oh, another. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> For God's sake, another radiant Blastoise. It's ridiculous. I wonder how many packs they're worth. Hmm, let's just see how many packs they're worth. Maybe um, trade the duplicates for packs. Open some more packs. Yep. Let's finish this off. Gyarados to finish. Wow. Oh, Oh, a little yawn here. Hmm. Let's um. So let's go and see what it's saying in the trade thing about Radiant Blastoise, because I know I must have about three of those now. Public offers. Let's have a look. Radiant Blastoise. Okay. Radiant Charizard. Nope. Only got the one, mate. Let's have a look here. Two for one pack? No, no, dog. That's crazy. Why do you need so many Radiant Blastoises? Two for one pack? Jesus Christ, is it really that common? Is Radiant Charizard that sought after as well? Bloody hell. Uh, yeah, I'm not doing that. Oh, well, I'm not going to be training them. Let's uh, get into a game instead, shall we? Let's get some games on, I think. Well, the only uh, deck, really, that I should be playing, opening all that Pokemon Go stuff, is, of course, a Mewtwo deck. So let's try a little bit of Mewtwo. I was going to throw some spicy sauce at you. No basics. As you can see, playing Mewtwo with Shadow Rider, Calyrex, VMAX. Oh, yes, I know, I understand how the rules work. I just realized I didn't change the uh, the sleeves and the deck box, it's kind of annoying. Okay, what do I want to start here with? I assume I want to get the Mew 2. And uh, yeah, let's, um, let's see what we can do here. We are going for, oh yeah, no. oh, okay, cool. Do that, do that. Uh, it's worth full crystal, no, it's not worth full crystal now. We can attach. Mm, yeah, we're done. We've got a means to draw cards here because we can evolve turn two to the V Max uh, to the V Star and the V Max. We can fog crystal for another energy. Draw two cards. It looks like we're playing against Dialga. So this um This is not um I can see this being not the best. Just because my opponent has the ability to obviously take that second turn to get the knockout. Gonna draw some cards. This is a uh, potential boss fuel here. I do think maybe that Mewtwo was the biggest sort of letdown, biggest like most potential but biggest letdown for this new set. Could have been epic. Could have been epic. But unfortunately, I don't think it was. 
or is, I should say. So our opponent does here, discard the Metal Energy of Quick Ball, got the Zashian, going for the Intrepid Sword variation. Pretty good idea, get to draw extra cards, and get some energy on the board as well if you want to, I suppose. Okay. Am I going to see a scoop up now? Yep. Come on now, let's see what we got here. I haven't even attached an yet. Hmm. I'm assuming no metal sources. No, no metal sources. Would love a Marnie. Whoa. Whoa. I know it looks like I've just stacked the game. I know I did the same thing with the booster pack. That was ridiculous. I think I might be psychic. Uh, let's draw some cards. I forgot there's Articuno in this deck. Oh, no, it's the bench, isn't it? Oh, that's fine. I keep making that error. I keep making that error with the Shadow Rider Calyrex. Uh, hmm. Do I get the Crobat into play just to draw some cards here? Before Imani, of course. I could draw a boss. If I draw a boss, then if I get like boss energy, I did not get boss energy. I didn't need any of those cards. It was a waste of a crowbat entirely. Well, it's time to Marnie. Although I'm sure I've just minded them as an energy. I'm sure I've just minded them into the energy that they actually want there. Uh, I attempted the star raid actually. One, two, three. Set up some knockouts. No, star raid later. Maybe if I punch this once, I could star raid the turn after. Do that. Let's get another moot. Uh, I suppose we just take the knockout here. Give it the old one, two. Just one off of the Mewtwo. Take a prize. Got the switch in hat. Oh, fucking bury that switch, aren't we? Hmm. Do with an air balloon. Could do with an air balloon. Energy search. Well, we haven't still haven't seen a metal saucer. Now I've said it. We're definitely going to see like five of them somehow. Another crowbar. Oh man, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wonder if there's some kind of spread deck to be using utilizing Star Raid because it can hit 120 onto all of these Pokemon. Oh my God, 120. Crowbat only 60 HP away from a knockout then. Oh, it's beautiful. That would be beautiful. Star Raid Rowler. Is that the deck? We can't have much much deck left. Where the hell are the metal sources? So I just wish I had four Durant in this deck now. Could just sort of mill them out. There's one. Oh. Three energy. Four energy. Needs another. Oh my god. Opportunity has stricken. <coughs> Excuse me. Draw. I love this right now.
Now I could no, that's not that's that's dumb. Oh, I could actually train core frog frog fog crystal uh, to get the other jigger out. I'm tempted to do that. I'm going to do that. Get some energy into play. Get the old Articuno here. Uh, use that drain court. Yeah. One, two. Get that in there. Uh, boom. Let's see, we did get an energy. That's nice. Might as well dump another Calyrex. Underworld door. To the moot. So we'll look here. We've got the Mewtwo for next turn via the Ultra Ball. Wait, did I play that this turn? Okay, I can Ultra Ball now. We'll get rid of Cancelling Clone and another Calyrex. Don't need those. Give me that bad boy. Yeah, yeah nice. Get that going. I think it's time. Right, if I star raid, everything takes damage. Then he takes two hit knockout. He takes two hit knockout. Two hit, uh, one hit knockout, one hit knockout, one hit knockout. I think this is probably the right play here. Boom. 120. Nice, I like it. Okay, definitely got the uh, the Star Kronos here, so it's gonna be interesting. Let's see. Oh, another Metal Saucer. Okay, and another one. That must be all four now. Three or four? Four. Scoop. Here he is. I'm gonna boss up. Okay. Dream 60. That was pretty good. So now, uh, how much damage is he doing here? 40 plus. So then, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That's 240. You can do 280. I might just have to give him the... Uh, I can just give him the Articuno here. Don't love it, but I don't hate it. Needs another boss, really. Bossing up the Crobat or bossing up the Mewtwo on the bench would be pretty annoying. There, there it is. Pretty good. We'll need another boss. I don't know how many of these tend to play. Do they play four? Because, um, I can do that. I can mine them. Right, let's get energy on this Articuno first. You can do 120 to 40. So I can at least knock out that Zashian on the bench. Hmm. No, oh, I don't know if I should have done that because I could have fought a deck out. Yeah, oh well. It's done now. No need to worry about it. It's Underworld Door. Into the Mute. Got the boss's orders for next turn. We like that. Psy Laser there. Take two. Now, even though I've got three prizes left, and they're all two and three prize Pokemon, really, I only need to knock out the Dialga. They need to boss something. They need to boss the Crobat. Oh, they've got Escape Rope. Uh, well, I need to send up this thing with the biggest HP, then. Oh, what? Seven? Oh. Oh, dang. <laughs> Fair enough. Well, that's um fair enough. That's pretty annoying. We'll uh, have to accept the loss on that one. Maybe we'll go for another game. Right, here we go again. Calling the heads. Lost the coin flip this time. That sucks. 
We're going to take what? First or second? Opponent going first. Got the Mewtwo start. Right, Dark Pack. Oh, God. <laughs> this is a scoop. <laughs> oh, no. Well. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, let's see what they're playing. Oh, yes, Gengar, my favourite to play against. Yes, I'm so happy. So this should be uh, not very interesting. Um, yeah. Saying again about how uh, Mewtwo was quite underwhelming. Here it is. Here is the underwhelming in action. Mm hmm. Oh, they got the setup. I'm going to take the hat off because it's bloody hot. Oh, God. I think my scalp might be a little bit sunburned from today. That sucks. More Pokemon to play. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm going to try and limit the V Pokemon to play as much as possible. Just so they can't use fear and panic. Uh, if I get two Vs in play, that's 240. If Choice Belt works before weakness, then that's Oblivion, basically, for everything. So maybe it doesn't matter. If it's after weakness, then I'm saved. I think a Shadow Rider will live with two Vs in play. This is... Oh my god, this is not good. Um... I'm doing it. I'm going to go for the early prize. Turn one, baby. Turn one. We are taking a prize. Turn one prize all round. Uh, we do get another basic. Been the old boss. Because we need this. Ooh. Do I draw some cards? No, I want this in play. Need to get this in play. Let's Psy laser the uh, 120 amps. I've got 130. Of course, it has 130. Uh, do I Psy laser? I'm going to Psy laser this Gengar actually. I'm just going to prep it. Prep it for death. Um, when it evolves, it's got 320. So that's uh, 220. It's only 200 health. Um, still going to need two energy from a Mewtwo and a choice belt. But I feel like my opponent's going to be annoyed by that. And that's the important thing. Of course, the purpose of Articuno in this deck, I think, is to just get the Mewtwo ready to punch. Unfortunately, it's not really going to work out in this scenario. So we're just going to play it out as is. Work with what we got, what we got here. There's the dark patch. You love it, you hate it. You hate to love it. Oh, God, you love to hate it. Oh. Maybe my opponent's not got anything else. As a training court. We like that. Because we can train court. And then draw some cards. With the energy we draw. Crobat V. A long pause. Okay. Crib, uh, Mew? No. Gengar. Gengar. Are you going to attach a Hiding Dark? Or are you going to Dark Slumber me for 80 damage? My opponent might be in a pick... Oh, no. Right, we lose our Mewtwo. I was going to Marnie anyway. So what was our next card going to be? 
Oh great, a cancelling cologne, my favourite. Well, we're definitely crowbatting this hand because this is absolute dog. So that's going to happen. There's a third energy, looks like getting the KO here. Pain explosion. He does damage to himself, doesn't he? Three damage going on. Oh, on this Pokemon, okay. Let's send him up, because I want to get the Mewtwo going. Oh, air balloon. That is exactly what I wanted to see. Can burn a switch off now, which is great. Can power pad. Definitely want a boss, definitely want a Marnie. These are two good cards that we want. Get them back in there. Crowbat for six. Yes, please. Oh, bloody hell. There you go. That's what we're talking about, right? That is what we're talking about. Underworld door. Onto the Mewtwo. Uh, he's got 60 HP left. My God. I can quite literally do this with basically anything. I'm going to drop the Horlucha because this time I'm actually hitting a VMAX. So we're going to do more damage to the VMAX. This is great. Uh, definitely dropping that as well. Beautiful. I don't know if I want to do a Marnie to them now. I feel like that's bad play. I'm tempted to boss that up and just KO it actually. No, it's dumb. Only one dark patch used. This could be squeaky bum time. Got the retreat cost. Uh, do I Marnie? Do I Marnie here? I just don't feel like my opponent has anything because I could be mining them into Gengars. Oh my god, I could. I should have bossed and then done it. Because there's more damage. Still, though, that was an alright play. That was a good play. I don't think my opponent was ready for that. Which is why they're like, wait, what did that do? How did that? What the, What did that? What, how? How what? You know? So that's good. We like that. that that's a good sign. It's going to take his time work out what the hell what has just happened. If I get a win with with Mewtwo against Gengar, I mean I know the the draw is not great, but still, if I get this, I'm going to be oh, it's going to be it's going to be good. Quick balling for nothing. That is always a good sign. The tool scrapper, you absolute hooligan! How dare you! How dare you? I don't even need the whole lucha now. I don't. Really, I don't need the choice belt because. Oh no! I'm gonna get KO'd. This is bad. One ninety uh, three. Yeah. <laughs> we'll need another dark patch. But can I return fire? I cannot because I cannot get three energy into play. What is the other? What is this? What is this do? Fifty. Dear God. No, mate. No, this is not good. This is the opposite of good. What's this do? Ten. Okay. Please do not get him out of the outer spot. Oh my god. You can just attach retreat. You can just attach retreat. I'm so sad. Oh no wait, have you already attached? No, that is not what you wanted to see. I mean, it is what you wanted. To, it's not what I wanted you to see. I wanted you to not see that. I wanted you to see something else. I wish I'd ultra board for something. I definitely. Oh no! Would, would bossing have made any difference there? 
I suppose it would have, because then we would have had to move it off the active spot. Uh, do I just give you a crowbar? It's probably okay, the crowbar. All right, go down to one prize left. I'll go also go down to one prize left. Draw, right, we're going to have to get some stuff going on here. I've got to hope that they don't boss. Hmm, get that on there, who knows. Far Crystal. Mm, is it even worth getting that into play anymore? Do I just use Calyrex from now on? I think maybe I just use the Calyrex from now. Okay. Mm. Do I fog? Do I fog? What's in there to get? That's the question. Got the Ultra Ball for next turn as well. Got the Ultra Ball and I got the Fog Crystal for next turn. I can always attach. It's got 200 HP. Dear me. Do I just feel like they have the boss in hand? That's the question. I feel like they do. I have a feeling. I can feel it in my balls. Okay. I wish I'd had the rock sand instead of that, but... Mm. I mean, at this point... 60... 6121 is okay so everything everything gets knocked out by fear and panic anyway um so i may as well there's nothing to lose from dropping the mewtwo into play because if you've got boss you can boss the calyrax anyway yeah there's no minus to playing the mewtwo just hoping i've put my opponent into a pickled spot that is a spot that's pickled in case you're wondering Yep. Nope. 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 Dark patch is used. Please say four. Two. Two. Oh, you got energy hand. Right, I'm rock sanding you, fool. You will be rock sand. Oh, you've gone rid of that, okay. Well, if they get the dark patch to set up, then... Ooh. Oh, dude. Well, that's that then. I suppose we lose then. Yep, we lose that game also. Uh, yeah, don't waste your money on Mewtwo v uh, V-Stars. I don't think it's that good. Um... But anyway, that's going to do it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. And uh, please do keep on watching and keep on trucking. And I'll see you again in the next video I do. Thank you very much. Goodbye.